my song. You are my song. You are my song. Oh, Sandy. I'm really screwed up now. Good job, Barry. Good job. How was your day? Oh. I am so sorry. No, no, that was completely my fault. I didn't mean to startle you. No, I just, I just should have had a better grip on the tray. Oh, listen, let me buy you a drink to say sorry. Oh, yeah, I'm not allowed to drink on the job. So I think the boss would be okay with that. Well, I am almost finished. I oh. like that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, Mom, hey, Jeffrey. Mm, sorry, we are closed. Ha <laughs> ha, very funny. Mom, I want a coffee. You do? Was I put on this earth to serve you, huh? Uh, you're too young for coffee. I'll get you a hot chocolate. How about that? Thanks, Jeff. I can always count on you. Right. I could put little marshmallows in it. Little bunny rabbits. And... School. Yeah. <laughs> Lord knows you've been here before it might help if you'd let yourself. So, <clears throat> your mom and I have uh, some big news. We're getting married. This is amazing. Now I can finally call you dad. Except, what about Barry? Barry? Barry. Wait, you still haven't divorced Barry? Well, how could I, honey? I never know where the damn guy is. And play the song that we keep talking about. It don't matter if we're in or we're out, but we're after you do. Yes, it will. Won't you play? Won't you play? Yeah. Darling, won't you play? I heard that the band might be in need of a guitar player. Sorry, man. Position's been filled. All right. No worries. Thanks. Whatever's in front of you. Whatever's behind you. All you got to do is. Mike Price? Yes, sir. Free beer the whole week. Want to put your name on it? <sighs> Free beer. Yep. Oh, what the hell? sure you want to do this? I want to go to camp. Once Barry signs these divorce papers, you can marry Jeffrey and I'll finally have a dad who's around. I'm just worried Barry will, well, pull a Barry. Well, honey, I just want you to know that this means so much to me and Jeffrey. And I don't want you to worry because he's going to show, okay? I hope so. Yeah, that's the bus. It's me. Gotta go. I'm gonna walk her out. Okay. Right. I miss you. I miss you too. Have a good time. Thank you. I will. All right. Sam's gonna have a great time at yeah. camp, and Barry's gonna sign the papers on Parents' Day. 
Look, listen, I just want you to focus on the wedding, okay? Okay. Now, are you sure you don't want me to help you plan? Are you sure? Because I'm not sure if you heard or not, but I do have my own restaurant. Yeah, I'm kind of good at planning. I kind of do that thing. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Mm. I'm going to handle the wedding planning. Meg, where is our little camp starlet camper posting up? What's your name? Sam S. for Stevenson. Right. It might be Childs. Yes, here we are, Sam mm -hmm. Childs. <sighs> what is this? I was assured a private cabin. If we're going to be roomies, there are rules that need to be followed. I'm here because Daddy is a major record label exec and he sits on Camp Starlet board. Major, duh. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, oh, oh. All right, let's rest up for a few minutes and remember to hydrate. <sighs> so, Daddy says when he comes out for Parents' Day tomorrow, he's all gonna take us to Nobu for dinner. <laughs> Isn't that major? Oh, so major. Yes, major. <laughs> <laughs> what are your parents going to do? Oh, I uh, called my dad, and he's actually performing for uh, Taylor Swift next week, so he can't come. That's major. <laughs> Wait, are you, like, totally serious? Totally major. Are you serious? Yeah. He's off and away on tour. He said that we might go off on a mega road trip after camp to watch him play. You know, I should probably go and practice my singing. <laughs> he, uh, he mentioned I might get up on stage. When is this major tour? Oh, uh, it starts this week. Interesting. I thought you said next week. I did. It goes two weeks. <laughs> Interesting. My dad knows Taylor Swift's agent, you know, and he said that Taylor is out of the country recording her next album. Are you going to tell anyone? I might. <laughs> we'll see. Awesome parents day, yes! <laughs> yes! Lucy, girls, your parents are here! Okay. <laughs> see you tonight. <laughs> Unless you'll be too busy touring. Sam back by curfew, which is at 10, that'd be super. Five, lol. <laughs> See, we got plenty of time, kid. All right, should we do it? You ready? All right, come on, let's get some food. Bye. Bye. Have fun. Oh, we will. Even though I love you. Okay. You're too heavy for me. Think of this place, huh? It's pretty cool, right? Yeah? You miss your dad? Kinda. Oh hey, you know what? I almost forgot. I uh I got you something. <laughs> so
It's a magnet. <laughs> yeah, it's a magnet. You love magnets. Oh, I thought that thing was funny. No comment. Hi. Hi. What can I get you today? Um. You know, I probably, I should probably go with the salad. I've been never trying to watch my calories. Although, Sammy, what do you say we split a burger? I'm vegetarian. A what? You are? Since when? Since forever. I'll have a veggie burger. Okay, veggie burger, and what else? And I'm gonna go with the, uh, the regular OG burger. Okay, one OG burger, one veggie burger it's coming up. It's just a regular burger. It's not light. Yeah, it's fine, I skipped the milkshake. No comment. What is this no comment thing? Where'd you get that? You got that from Jerry, didn't you? Jeffrey? Yeah, because he's around to teach me things. You know, he proposed to mom. Sick. What? That's sick. Right? That's what all the cool kids say. So, your mom's getting married to Jesse. Jeffrey. This is the last thing stopping the wedding. And what do you do after I sign these? Suffer through two more painful weeks of camp and then we'll go home. Really? So camp hasn't even been that much fun for you? Not unless you consider rich brats fun. <laughs> they gotta get more fun the older you get. Which has nothing to do with anything. Thank you so much. <laughs> there it is. I was thinking, you and me, maybe we could, um... You know what, no. No. I don't think, no, you know, forget it. I don't think you'd be interested, actually. It's a terrible idea. You'd probably hate it. What were you gonna say? Don't. Oh, that's right. No, but you know what? It's one tell of those me. things that. I, but really, it's one of those Just things tell me. that. Okay. I'm heading up to San Francisco for a music competition on Sunday. The winner gets 25 grand. Skip can for the weekend and then come up with me. Like, I would want to go anywhere with you, Barry. Okay, then, then fine. You know, if you want to go back to suffering a painful camp, then, then go up to San Fran and rock out with your dad, then that's on you. You got nobody to blame but yourself. Right, because it's never your fault. Always putting the blame on someone else. That's not what I'm doing. Kid, I'm just you kidding. Know, Jeffrey kid, always I takes was responsibility just, I was just for me, for himself. Okay? He's always there for me for birthdays, for Christmas. Okay. You know the Christmas <laughs> presents you get? Mom sends them. They're not for me. Nothing is. If I had it my way, I would have spoken to you since you left. She was left. Okay. Well, I guess if you'd rather go back to camp than hang out with your awful dad, I'll, uh... I'll drop it back off after lunch. Are you gonna tell anyone? I might. <laughs> we'll see. I wouldn't have to go back to camp all weekend. Not till Monday. As long as mom's okay with it. And the camp. As much as I hate it there, I don't want them to think I've been kidnapped. Yeah, of course, of course. No, you know what? We'll call him right now. Papers? You need to sign them? Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. Miss, can I, do you have a, a... She didn't hear me. That's fine, though, that's fine, because now, kiddo, we got the whole weekend to sign these things. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna throw these in the car, I'm gonna call the camp, I'm gonna call your mom, and then you and me, kiddo, we hit the road, all right? Just you and me. Sound good? I'll be right back. Finish your food. music you like? Taylor Swift. Yeah, Taylor Swift. She's pretty good. In fact, you know, she was performing at a venue I was at the other night. Seriously? Mm -hmm. You played at an actual venue? A venue with Taylor Swift? Did you see her? Technically, I, I, didn't, I didn't play there, but she's gonna be playing there next season. Yeah. Now, I was just walking past and there was a sign that said they needed extra acts, and so I went in and, uh, they said, uh, no. Not technically, they didn't say no. They said, come back later. So that's what I'm going to do.
fucking voice. You sound just like your mom. She sounds so much better than I do. No, uh You sound just like her. When you were little, we used to sing together all the time. It's true. When you were little, we'd sing Annie, The Sound of Music, and play guitar, and you and your mom would dance all over the house and sing together. You know, you especially like I'm that. I'm not much for singing anymore. Did you miss it? No. Singing reminds me of you. Come on. It wasn't all that bad, was it? She's not. This happens all the time. Just a little overheated is all. This is a quick fix. God, it stinks. <coughs> no, it's all good. Just needs to rest overnight. <coughs> a little overheated is all. <coughs> yeah, right. Broke down on the side of the road. No big deal. No, nope, not broke. Not broke down. Just uh, resting. <coughs> hey, you know what? It's a golden opportunity. First castle is right up the road. What do you say we leave the car here to rest overnight? And uh, you and me, we go find a nice little hotel, relax a little bit, and then uh, we can go on a nice father-daughter sightseeing tour. I mean, that doesn't sound so bad. Right? But I'm not so bad. Uh, map the nearest hotel, would you? Uh, I can't. I don't have any service. You sure? That's okay. I think I've been in this neck of the woods before. You know, I think there's actually a place right up, right up the, uh, the road here. Ready to huff it then? Nothing can smell as bad as this car does right now. Ah, she'll be as good as new. Nah, she'll be good in the morning. That wasn't that far. Up the road, my foot. We walked like five miles. Come on, it's three tops. We passed two hotels on the way. Yeah, but this one's cheaper. And we made it. Hey, get a room for the night, please. All right. Room 220. Seems good for the night, right? <laughs> You were saying? Let's get inside. Yeah. Oh. I told you we should have gone to those other hotels. Don't run. It's a nice place. It's just a gunshot. Don't worry about it. I want to go home. So the male ushers his offspring inside. Nature has found its place. Well, I think places like this have a certain charm. I'll tell you the truth. Some of the best rock and roll guitarists in the world, they used to stay in places like this. Whatever, Barry. Maybe we could just go to the castle now. The less time spent in here, the better. You know, about that kiddo, I think the castle's probably already closed for the day. Great. But, uh, but hey, we can go next time. Right? And you know, there's probably a fee to get in, and you know, I'm not working right now. So. Yeah, I know. It was my fault for believing you anyway. It's a classic. You know, when you were little, you used to love watching black and white westerns. You wanted to be Dale Evans singing Cowgirl. I was a weird kid. <laughs> You're still a weird kid. I'm not a kid anymore. I'm 15. 
And I definitely don't want to be Dale Evans. What do you want to be? Huh? Hey, how's school? It's fine. Fine? That's good. You, uh, join new clubs? Debate, chess team. Debate, chess team? Kidding me? What, I raise a nerd? Well, Jeffrey says. Why don't you, like, join choir or something? You got such a great voice, just like your mom. Yeah, I know, like my mom's, you said. And like I've said already, I'm not much for singing anymore. <sighs> That's a shame. When you were younger, you used to run around the house. Yeah, you've said that before, too. Okay? I'm not little anymore, and you weren't around to watch me grow up. You're right. I did it. Whatever. It's fine. I'm used to it. Hello? Hi, this is Jody from Camp Starlet. We were calling because Sam didn't check in with the rest of the camp members last night. What? Hmm. Camp just called. Sam didn't check back in. She must still be with Barry. Oh, right. Barry. <gasps> Barry! Oh! I have to call her. Hi, honey, it's mom. How are you? Um, camp called and said you didn't come home last night. I'm sure it's nothing, but I just wanted to check on you, so if you could call me back, that'd be great. Love you. Bye-bye. Oh, hey, what's up? It's Barry. I'm on stage with Dave Grohl. Leave a message. Barry? What in the hell have you done? You call me back as soon as you get this, okay? No answer? No answer from both of them, and now I'm really worried. What are you gonna do? Portland Station. Hi, my name's Denise. Um, I have an emergency. My daughter is in Santa Barbara, and I think she might be in trouble. Checking out. Thank you much. Have a lovely stay. Appreciate it. You know, we're making pretty good time, actually. <laughs> Want to hop on the one the rest of the way? Get the scenic route? More time to bond that way. I, uh, you hungry? Enough shrugging. Are you hungry, yes or no? Because I am. How about a burger? For breakfast? I'll get a, uh, a real greasy, nice, juicy burger, and you can get a tasteless veggie burger. How's that sound? The greasy spoon is one of those. Ugh, greasy spoon is the worst. Whatever. Is that where we're going? No comment. I'll follow you. Keep your hands where I can see them. That's right, just stay put and no one gets hurt. Keep quiet! Who are you? Whoa! Get on the ground. Uh, we, 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 we just, we just want to have a veggie burger. I said get on the ground. Don't want your kid to be fatherless, do you? No, she wouldn't be. she got Jeremiah. It's Jeffrey. Put the gun down. Put this thing down, would you? It's gone on long enough. Come on, let's get you out of here. Something bad actually happened. Sandy, what are you doing on the ground? Get up. It's dirty down there. Let's get out of here. This is why I'm a vegetarian. My skateboard. Yeah, that's the last thing you should worry about right now, kid. Come on. Hello? Nine one one. Get in the car.
okay, sweetie? Yeah. You just took the gun. You weren't afraid or anything. Nope. You're a hero. I wouldn't say that. You saved all those people. Well, those people were never in any real danger to begin with. And were they, kid? What? Sorry, have I completely missed something here? Or weren't we just kidnapped? By an armed gunman? Ah, uh, by a stupid gunman. With a plastic gun. Yeah, and you kidnapped me. You tried to shoot us! Uh, to be clear, I didn't try to shoot nobody. I just needed the money. Okay, let's not play the whose crime is the bigger crime game here, kid. Just tell me your name. Dylan. Good. Dylan. Now, whereabouts do you live? Come on, buddy. I'm not here to judge you. I mean, hell, because of me and Sam here, we're in the back of a pretty cool VW bus, as opposed to in the back seat of a cop car. No comment. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> hey, what's so funny? <laughs> flights left tonight, and I'll be halfway to Santa Barbara by then. Plus, I don't want to be in an airplane in case Sam tries to call, you know? You're totally right. I get it. Just go. Don't you worry about anything but Sam, all right? I'll be right here taking care of everything. I got everything handled. Everything. I... I love you. Love you, too. Did you happen to get a look at his face? You know, now that I think about it, it was kind of weird that the robber went with him. It's always the same trick. One guy plays the bad guy, the other guy, the hero. There's something that confuses me, and it's, it's why is this gig so sloppy? The easy to spot getaway car, the, e even the, the the score. It's not big enough. It's, it's 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 not as big as they normally go after. Something stinks. It smells like baby boo boo. They think I'm an idiot, but my mama didn't raise no fool. You understand me? Their cockiness is gonna be their downfall. Tell me where you live. You're gonna make it all the way up to San Fran with us. Okay. I'm sure your mother would. Dad? Yeah. Dad, cool. Don't got one. Yeah, I know what that's like. Well, come on, Dylan. You got no family at all? You're in foster care my whole life. In and out. No one's ever cared about me. I know one's gonna care about me now. Parents. They only want the young ones, you know. Figured I'm almost 18 anyway, so I don't care what you take. All right. It's settled then. One trip for three to San Fran. Come right up! What's up in San Francisco? Music competition. I'll have you know I'm pretty sick guitar player. <laughs> sick? Yeah, it's still not cool. What happens if you win the competition? It's a cash prize. 25 large. What are you gonna do with the money if you win? Yeah. We're out of studio. You call my first sick album. Hey, that's not a bad one, right? right? Maybe I can throw down a few lines. Hell yeah, absolutely. Ooh. Hey Sam, maybe you can sing uh, some backup. I don't know. You sing? She's got one of the best voices you ever heard. Ah, oh, tell they want to hear you sing. Yeah, but she doesn't sing for this anyone, though. You gotta be, uh, gotta be pretty special. Which you are, Dylan! You record an album with Barry and Sam Childs, father-daughter rock star team extraordinaire! Woo! Woo! Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm still hungry. Robert just does not feel the stomach like he used to. Oh, I could go for a steak. Oh, finally, another meat eater. <laughs> this one's a vegetarian. What's that? Yeah. No comment. <laughs> Hello? Hi, babe. Hey, hey, babe, have you heard from Sam? Hi, honey, not yet. Do you want me to join you? I will hop on the next flight right now. 
Oh, no, that's very sweet, but I want you to stay there in case she calls. Do you think you can handle the wedding planning by yourself while I'm gone? I have everything under control, all right? You just focus on finding Sammy. Thank you. I'm worried, you know? What if he hasn't even fed her? She's probably gone all day without a snack. I could get used to being a vegetarian. Mm, Mom never lets me have whipped cream. What? Mm. Pancakes aren't pancakes without whipped cream. Hey! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! Hey. Oh, you're gonna get it now. <laughs> oh, baby, I gotta go. I don't know how long I'm supposed to be on the five. Uh, of course, baby, I love you. All fine here, no worries. Okay. All righty, all right. How hard can this be? I wish that was for us for a second. Don't I feel silly? <laughs> yeah, silly. Some. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe we should just wait another minute. Let him get a get a head start. Yeah. Stay here. Eat some more pancakes. And your mom? She used to love pancakes, soy sauce. Ew. Yeah. That's gross. And she was pregnant with you, yeah. Sounds okay. How can you say that? Ooh, sweet and salty. I get it. You know what else she loved? She loved iced tea, but with salt instead of sugar. Ew. Ew. I can't defend that one. It's amazing you turned out as normal as you did. I've never gotten this hung without texting mom before. Oh, don't worry. Hasn't been that long, and plus your mom's got Johnny. Jeffrey. Exactly. He's there to look after the house while you're away. Hello? Is this Jeffrey Stevenson? Yeah, this is Jeffrey. I'm sorry, who's this? This is Detective Green. Detective Green? We flagged a VW van with Oregon plates. Is this correct? Yeah, VW van with Oregon plates. That's Barry's. We're currently surveilling. God, is that me? Is that my plushie too? It's that old? That old? You and that plushie are exactly the same age, you know? The day that you were born, I put that plushie in the crib. Oh my God, look at your mustache. Hey, mustache was styling back then. That's a pretty cool guy. He had uh, one of the best bands in all of Portland. <laughs> Cause that's where true rock and roll is. Hey, easy, you making fun of me? What happened to the band? Well, the lead singer, Jimmy, down the car wreck. And couldn't find anyone to replace him. The rest of the guys, they kind of just drifted apart. They got real jobs. But not me. I never give up on my music. You're really passionate. Mm-hmm. I don't know what to do in my life like Barry. I don't have a family that's good to me the way your dad is to you. Dylan, that's all right. No kid your age knows what they want to do yet. And anyway, you got us as family now. We kidnapped you, remember? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> I love this is that song. Oh, you both know this song? Yeah, I love this song. Maybe I'm fine. I got you in my guitar. I got you and my
you didn't tell my mom. Wait, Sammy. Sammy, stop. Listen, hear me out. You didn't tell my mom? Sammy, I, I try. Oh. Dylan, here, call, call AAA while we still got yeah, service. Sure. They got a few days left on my subscription before they cancel it. Sammy, listen to me. I'm so sorry. Listen, please. Let me explain. Hi. You didn't call my mom. You didn't call the camp. They think I've gone missing. They probably called the police. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't think it'd be such a big deal. I mean, is it really my fault that I wanted to spend just a little bit of time with my own daughter? It's never your fault. Say, say, listen. The car's gonna be fine in a little bit. This happens all the time. I promise you. A little bit gonna be as good as new. Mom, pick up, please. Come on, pick up. Pick up the phone. Hi, you've reached Denise. Sorry, kiddo. You don't get it, do you? It's not about the stupid car. It's about you missing my childhood. It's about you abandoning me when I was little because you'd rather leave your family than give up on music. Hey, baby, are you in Santa Barbara? What time is it? I'm close. Uh, I haven't had service for the past couple of hours. Is Sam called yet? No, but the police called. Uh, they flagged Barry's Oregon plates. They did? Where is he? Apparently, his car was in a, 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 a getaway vehicle in an alleged robbery. A wha what? Where? About an hour and a half north of Santa Barbara. I pinned you to the location the cops gave me. Okay, um, babe, I love you. I gotta look at the pin. I'm gonna go kill Barry. I love you too, babe. Um, you know, I never realized how hard it would be without you. And I'm, uh, I'm just so glad to have you in my life. I really am. Means, honey. Talk about it later. Barry! Good news is you still have AAA. Bad news is your service doesn't cover roadside assistance on weekends. Please make a U turn. You've gone the wrong way. Turn around now. But you gotta push! Dylan, I need your help! No! Oh, oh, first you want me in the car and I'm gonna push? Yeah, push. please just hide. Push harder, guys! Yeah, there we go. Keep pushing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. It's going. Progress. Hey, don't, don't turn it so far to the right, Sammy. Please don't turn it so... Please make a U-turn. You've gone the wrong way. It's Barry to Barry. Turn oh. around now. Ah. How close are we to an auto shop? Um, I, you know, I think there's one up here at the, the bend in the road uh, by the campground, I think. Yeah, because you're such a trustworthy guy. Hey, I got you for this. Just need to remind Sam of all your good qualities. Oh, yeah? And what are those? Oh, you know. If I can't think of nothing, I'll just make it up. Hey. Not now. I just want to be alone. Ah, uh, things look rough now, but once we get to the shop, things will start to look up. Things will look up when I'm back in Portland with my mom and my new dad. No more Barry. Oh, I'll have him then if you don't want him. Why would you want him? Because he means well. And if I had someone who loved me half as much as your dad loves you, then I might be a different person. Different person, eh? I like you as this person. And your dad saved this person from jail today. I'll cut him some slack. 
You guys better not be making out over there. Shut up! You're underage. I'm not doing anything, old man. Not old. Miss you. Oh. Yeah, I am. Um... <laughs> what happened? My tire's flat. So this is the place where cars come to die. Yeah, not they're just resting. Damn it. What's what's the matter? I don't want to spare. I I had a flat just last month and I, I replaced that one, but I didn't replace the spare, and I just I haven't had time to go to the auto shop to finish the job. Well, hey, that's 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 no problem. I got a spare in my in my truck. You give up your spare for me? I mean, it's not like his car needs it, it's dead. It's resting, it's resting. I told you that. And yeah, no, I don't. I'll grab it. Okay. You have missed your turn. Are you guys campers? We're thieves. N not us. Right. They're kidnappers. Thieves. Kidnappers? Oh, they're, not, they're, they're, they're kidding. Kids kind of <laughs> shut up. No, we, uh, we're just making a whip to San Francisco, and we ran into a little bit of car trouble is all. A lot of car trouble. Overheated is all. I'll find a shop tomorrow, take her in, get her fixed, bing, bang, boom. Ah. You have not reached your final destination yet. Hey. Okay. There you go. Thank you. My pleasure. Really, that was so sweet of you. Oh, it's nothing. Thank you. Okay. Bye. All right. Hey, do you guys, do you guys have anywhere to stay tonight? Yeah, no, we got the... We got Absolutely the... not, and I'm not walking five miles to another motel again, so no, we don't. We'll be fine. Nonsense. You helped me. My mother would be rolling over in her grave if I didn't return a favor. I insist. I insist. Lady insists? She insists. You're not really thieves, are you? <laughs> no, I will explain everything. Maybe over some wine. <laughs> Gotta get my stuff. Uh, Sammy, grab the keys. It's my guitar, my oh. hat. It's on the dash. Uh, I should you have a jacket and a shirt in the back seat. Maybe a change of clothes for tomorrow. Come on, it's your car. Leave the gun in the car. <laughs> change that kid's life. I just wish that Santa felt as positive about me as you do. She will. Well, maybe after the teenage phase wears off. <laughs> so you live here with your husband? Um. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to pray. No, it's fine. It's, um, no, no husband. No kids, just, uh, it was just me and my mom until last year. Oh, man. I'm sorry for bringing it up. Mm, it's okay. It's not that, you know, I didn't want the family life. It just, it just never found me, I guess. And um, now, so many years have passed. It... Yeah, no, I get it. I mean, before I knew it, I was, I was married, and then next thing I knew, I was a father. All I wanted to do was play guitar. That sounds selfish, but I'm getting that second chance now. I'm being a father. I think you're doing great. Where do Dylan's parents live? He says he doesn't have any. He's a foster kid who never found the right home. And you know, it gets harder and harder as you get older. Well, I cannot believe that we drank this entire bottle. Can't. Uh, I can. It's, it's just a, it's a thing I say. Why are you doing me stupid? No, no. No. <laughs> um, 
Um, I, I better, I better get to bed. Yeah. You will make it to the mechanic, okay? He's only two blocks away or so. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we'll be, we'll be fine. Yeah, that doesn't look good. Really? No, that's bad. Bad? No, you got a leak in your intake pipe. Oh, you guys hear that? I knew it. What's the, what's the intake pipe? Hmm? What's the intake pipe? Oh, yeah, uh, I saw the exact same thing last week. Family came up here, they were trying to go camping. And the car broke down, guess what it was? Intake pipe. Intake pipe. Same exact thing that's going on in here. 20 minutes later, boom, 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 had them up. On their way to the campground, all they missed were the bears. Wow. That's probably one of the only times you actually want to be on time to miss something, huh? There you go. Says the expert at missing things. Ouch. Um, okay, so good. So easy, easy fix then. Super easy fix. Good. No That's problem. great. Then we can probably still make it up to San Francisco in time for the competition tonight. Oh, great. The only thing you care about. Ouch. She does not like you. Um, okay, so good. So we can... Yeah, let's uh, go inside. We'll do the necessary paperwork and we'll get you guys on your way. No more than 48 hours. You just said 20 minutes. Yeah, it'll only take me 20 minutes to fix it. 17 if I have an extra cup of coffee. Then you just said two days. Yeah, I gotta order the intake pipe. I don't have like a, like a, like a basket of intake pipes, like a wicker basket just overflowing with intake pipes sitting around. If I had it, I'd put it right over there, but I don't have one. Okay, no, I, you know, no, I, I see what's going on here. You know what, guys, why don't we, uh, Take a little uh, walk and see what other shops are in town. You know what, before you take off, listen to this, this is super funny. You're gonna laugh in particular when you hear this. Uh, I was looking at this and I was thinking it's a 68. It's not, it's an 86. See what I did with the eight and the six? I flipped them. Ha ha ha. Like that? I told you you were gonna. Uh, I 100% have an 86 and take pipe in there. Just like that? Yeah. So, 300 bucks, I'll get you up and out of here. No problem. Wait, three, 300 bucks? I mean, it's a rush job, it's not an easy fix. She just said it was. Well, yeah, it'd be easy for me. I'm a highly skilled, this is my job. You're not gonna find it any faster or cheaper than that. Okay, 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 um, okay. Uh, let me just, uh, <laughs> let me move some funds around real quick, I guess. I hope he moves some of the funds over here, over this direction, like toward me. What kind of engine did you say it was? Uh, in terms of... 86 or 68? Oh, I thought it was a 68, but it turned out it was an 86. Can I have a look? <sighs> Such a screw up. You uh, don't have the money, do you? God, I'm not a screw up. People just need help. Yeah, well, thanks, Dylan. You're a sweet kid. I don't have the money, which means that I won't make it up to San Francisco for the show. But that's okay. It also means that I have to call Sam's mom. That's gonna be a boatload of fun. What if you had 300 bucks? Dylan, I promise you, I don't. Whew. Super dirty, right? You see all that dust on it? Not even that. Like, the oil gauge is completely off. Don't even get me started on the water pump. I. I won't get you started on that. Put it in perspective, I've got a better shot at inventing uh, teleportation, okay, than coming up with 300 bucks in time. Well, beam me up because, uh... Holy jeez, wait a minute. He's dead. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. I didn't want you to hate me. Dude, I could never hate you. But this is, this is the stolen money. You're not taking stolen money. You accepted a gift. I don't think that's how stealing works. Look, take it. Live out your dreams, and after you win the competition, then we will have more than enough to pay back the greasy spoon. Good thinking. But in the meantime, listen to me. No more spending other people's money. You hear me? Oh, you can have it all. You got more? Yeah. The money coming out of all places. Oh, wow. All right. What is that? Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, I mean, that's, uh, that's that, too. You got money coming out of everywhere. This has got to be like, what is this, almost 500 bucks? Like, you're mad at your dad. You probably aren't going to tell him 
that you know things about cars, I kind of wanted him thinking I was the only one who knew what I was talking about. So probably it's not really any benefit for you in telling him things, right? Like you know what that. If you fix it for $200, I won't tell my dad. I thought I'd be happy with the money, but I'm happier now with you and Sam. I'm happier now, too. Yeah, good thinking. That's sweet. Is there a bank in this area? Because I'm trying to make a deposit. Well, you shouldn't. If you deposit all your money, then you won't be able to pay it to me to fix your car. Then I can put it on my credit card, and then I can get the points. In two miles, there is a restroom, a gas station, a diner, a... Good to go, but I would like to recommend trading it in. Let it die with dignity. She's a beaut. You're so Good weird. Old. Thank you. All right, guys. Uh, you know what we should do? We should, uh, we should probably thank Sage. And my phone's dead. Mine, too. I forgot to charge it last night because of all the excitement. Do you have a charger? No. Why don't you have a charger? I, I don't know. I don't have one. You don't have one. I left all my stuff. I can't where you kidnap me from. Shh. I robbed a greasy spoon. Shh, shh, shh. I need to call Mom and Jeffrey and Camp. It's been days. It's been two days. Big deal. Hey, you know what? Sage will probably have a charger. Why don't we stop by her house before we hit the road? Plus, it won't be the right thing to do to just head out without saying bye first. Right. It's the only reason. Fortune 845, sir. Yeah. Hey. Run a plate for me, will you? Gotcha. I just remember if her house was blue or it was like purple color. You don't remember the house you were at two hours ago? I was on there one night. I thought it was red. Do you see any red houses on this whole street? But literally, there are none around here. I don't think that's what he's here for, Dylan. I'm sorry for everything I did. Okay, Dylan, take it easy, buddy. It's all right, relax. Just relax. We're gonna be okay, aren't we? With Barry handling? Put your hands on your head and kneel on the ground. Officer, you too, out of the vehicle. Officer, hi, hello. Um, um, why are we under arrest? I have a few theories myself, but I'd like to hear it from you. Because you're thieves. I'm charging you all with armed robbery. Oh, <laughs> you got you got it all wrong with all due respect, sir. Do I? Yeah. We didn't rob the greasy spoon. I did. It was just me. I was the mastermind behind this entire plan. You? Really? You think the 17-year-old kid is more capable of armed robbery than me? <laughs> no, sir. I'm the one who's wrong. I robbed the greasy spoon because I needed the money because I'm a deadbeat. I'm a screw-up who can't do anything right, who can't even have one nice parent's day with his own daughter. Yeah, that's touching. But the kids are accessories at best. Victims, sir. They're victims. The boy willingly took the manager's money. You didn't arrive to the scene until later. Well, yeah, because that was all part of the plan. In fact, if that kid's a robber, then how come I got all the money. Watch yourself. That's not the way the law works. You're under arrest. Turn around. Wait, sir. No! Sir. Sir, I... Please, please. <laughs> right this way. Harry! I'm sorry, Sam. It's okay. Don't worry, Sammy. Yeah. 
I'm not gonna cuff you guys. So we just get in the car. Where are you gonna take us? Until we can find another parent, we, we're gonna put you in foster care temporarily. Hell no. I'm not going back. Sam, we gotta run! Hey! Hurry! I ain't running after no kids. Then I had a heart attack. Dylan, what's wrong? I'm so glad you're here. You saved us. I never want to go back to foster care. Hey, no one's going to put you back in foster care. Where's Barry? This is all your fault. If you never robbed that stupid greasy spoon, Barry wouldn't be in jail right now. I know. I'm sorry. Just think, if Dylan hadn't done what he did, then none of us would be together either. There was that. Okay, you've both had a long weekend. I will make you some hot chocolate and ham sandwiches, and then we can solve this whole problem later, okay? She's a vegetarian. Where do you think they took Barry? Oh, well, there's a jail close by. It's probably where he went. Your mom must be worried sick. Do you want to call her? It's been three days since I last called her. I don't know. And you should call your mom, sweetie. I just don't want her to think that Barry messed up again. I understand. I wouldn't want anyone to know what's happening to Barry now, either. You really like him, huh? He's the only one who's ever done anything nice for me. He got arrested for me, for God's sake. I don't know if any of my foster families would have done that. They've had a rough life. It's getting better every minute. <clears throat> we better hit the road, then. We gotta go get Barry. Barry Childs? That's me. You made bail. What, really? You did? How? It's taken care of. Now we wait. Very cute. Oh, yeah, that's uh, my daughter. Well, Mr. Childs, it's been a pleasure. Thank you. Um, no offense, but I don't think I'll be coming back. I was just thinking you'd outstayed your welcome. So long, then. Sammy. Oh. Mm. How'd you find me? Sage. The heroes need help. <clears throat> I'm so, so sorry, Sammy. I've been a terrible father. Hey, I know I'm still a terrible father. I spent this short trip of ours together trying to win some stupid music competition when I should have been, been focused on you. That's right, your competition. What time is it? Uh, it's four already. What time does the competition start? Mm, eight. You can make it. That's okay. I don't have to go. I got my family now. That's all well and good, but I wasn't kidnapped, robbed, kidnapped again, and dragged halfway up the coast to not make it to that stupid competition. We're going. We are? Hell yeah, we are. And we're gonna win. Oh, <laughs> you guys are amazing! And then, when I win, then I can pay back the money that you stole from the Greasy Spoon. And I'll definitely pay you back, Sage. I know you will. All right, let's get you back to your car. Come on.
this happen? You were arrested for hours. Uh, two hours. Hasn't been towed. Yeah. Lucky. Hurry up, Barry. Yeah, I'm, I'm hurrying. Seriously, we're wasting time. I know this is a uh, this is sudden, but um, we might not get another chance. So, is that it? I don't want to come out too strong. Hurry right, up! man. Better, uh, better go. <laughs> but uh, thank you. Barry Child's posted bail approximately an hour ago. How is that possible? Well, it's actually quite common. You, you see, people commit crimes, get arrested, and then they're not too happy I about... Kn I know how bail works. Do you know? Yes. When Barry posted bail, was there a little girl with her about 15 years old, cute as a button? Yes, there was. But she was not taken into custody, so I have no record of her. When was Barry released? As I said... Approximately an hour ago. Who posted bail? That's confidential. Okay. Uh, did he say where he was going? That, too, is confidential. Why is that confidential? Because I don't know. Well, then why didn't you just say you don't know? I prefer confidential. <clears throat> did my daughter say where they were going at all? <laughs> why would anybody talk to me about the travel plans? They would be right. Hey, this is Jeffrey. Leave me a message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Barry posted bail somehow, and he thinks that Sam's with him, but he's not sure. Oh, babe, I gotta go. That's Sam on the other line. Hey, Mom. I'm sorry it took so long to call. It's been a crazy few days. Are you okay? Everything's fine. Yeah, we're safe and we're all together. Honey, who, who's we, honey? Where are you? We're headed up to San Francisco to this place called Funky Beat. There's this music competition there tonight. The winner gets 25 grand. Sam? Barry got arrested today. You went missing from camp. Do you have any idea how worried I've been? I know, Mom. I'm sorry. But I'm, I'm fine. Dad's fine. We're all together. OK, honey. Um, I guess as long as you're OK. I am, Mom. I got to go. I love you. Did you talk to Sam? Yeah, she, uh, she's with Barry, and they're going to some music festival in San Francisco. Sounds like something Barry would do. Are you coming home? Absolutely not. I'm going to San Francisco. For you. Oh, are you ready to see your dad rock out? <laughs> yes, I am. Uh, Barry Child's coming at you. What do you mean I'm not on the list? Not seen any Barry Child's on the list. But that's impossible. And plus, we went through a whole lot to get here. Can't help you, man. Oh, wait. I see what happened. Your check bounced. <sighs> no, that can't be. Sorry, man. But hey, you guys can still go in and enjoy the show. Why don't you guys grab a table and the next act's about to start. Okay. Thanks. Come on, guys. Amazing, great work. Next up, we have the lovely, the talented Maya Stein. Now remember, folks, we're streaming live all night, so make sure you tell all your friends and families at home to watch the show with us. Don't go. 
really sorry I put you through all this. It's okay. I'm happy I got to spend the weekend with you. She put so much energy into just three short minutes. I'll tell you, the next act is going to be hard to follow, but give it up for Matt and Missy! Excuse me? How much was it to reserve the spot? It's too late, kid. You can't reserve a spot that's already in progress. My dad and I drove for three days just to get up here, and I haven't seen him in a year. This is the only time I've seen him perform. There's really nothing you can do? Would you even have the money to pay for the spot if I said you could? All right, I'll tell you what. I'll let you know if an act doesn't show. But don't get too excited. It doesn't usually happen. Thank you. Thank you. You won't regret this. All right, get out of here. Did you wake up from your sleep this morning? Did you, you find out that you're You know, girl alive? stuff. Could have said the bathroom. Just watch the show. Your body move. I'm asking you if you're alive. Come alive. I can perform if an act doesn't show. Great. I hope that happens. I was hoping more that you could lock the back door so that if any talent's late, they can't get in. Isn't that cheating? Would it really be the worst thing you've done this week? Did you find out that you're my bride? Do you love me like I love you? Look in my eyes, I'm telling you to come alive. Really stuff. Just boring old bathroom stuff this time. Ugh. What are you doing? Um, I was. You're not just... stopping anyone from performing. All, right? All you're doing is giving me a headache. You're trying to bump someone in the eye to kick you and your dad out of here for that. No, 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 please don't. I'm sorry. Barry doesn't know what I'm doing. I'm trying to be a nice guy here. I'm trying to give your dad a chance. You said all the acts usually show. Well, what do you want me to do, kid? <sighs> How much stage time does each act usually get? That's me. Well, you're in luck, man. Did an act drop out? No, that never happens. Oh. But the last three acts have all gone a little bit short. So if you can keep it to three minutes instead of five, you got yourself a spot on stage. But you got to go now. What? Ladies and gentlemen, we have a slight change in our lineup today. All the way from who knows where. Let's give it up for Barry Childs. This is Barry Childs with daughter Sam Childs featuring Dylan. Uh, sorry, Dylan, I don't know your, your last name, but uh, if you want, you up for it? Let's do it. What's the song? Your favorite. Excuse me, uh, was there a girl here uh, about this tall, 15 years old, long purple hair? 
a lot of girls here. With go purple ahead. hair? I mean, feel free to go take a look. Now I got you and my guitar. Now I got you and my words and my song. You and my soul. America, it's a nation of assimilation, but now you're listed out of radio stations. Try to make me fall, feel small, but now we stand tall. One, two, three, four, five. So let me introduce myself, Dylan's a name, because no doubt you'll hear my name again. Woo! to see you as well, Denise. What the hell were you thinking? Do you have any idea how worried I've been? I, I wasn't, I wasn't thinking. I, you never think. Now that you mention it. Yeah, that's clear. Are you the robber? Ex-robber? Future musician. Oh, not another one. Mom, this is Dylan. He's my friend, my good friend. You're singing? And you have a good robber friend. I have to sit down for a second. Nice to meet you, Sam's mom. I'm so interesting. We're so glad we're safe. Didn't you see us up on stage? We were more than safe. We were, we were pretty good. We were more than pretty good. You were awesome guitar, man. And Sam, your voice really is the greatest I've ever heard. Whatever. You came up with that whole verse on the spot. That was unreal. Do you have a, does anyone have a pen? We had so much fun. Thank you so much. <sighs> well, Denise, I'm so sorry that this took so long. I was afraid that once I signed these divorce papers, that now I know that Sam and I will always be family. Always. Are you gonna be okay? Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna be... You're just fine. We'll figure it out. I just want you to be happy. Thank you, Barry. That means a lot to me. And that, don't worry about me. I'm gonna be fine. I'll figure it out. I just want you and, and Joseph to be happy. It's Jeffrey, Dad. Jeff, Jeffrey. Jeffrey. Yeah. You deserve happiness. <laughs> That's a cute act I got there. Oh. Where'd you get the kids? Would you believe me if I told you I kidnapped him? <laughs> <laughs> Funny, too. Yeah. Great watching you. Ooh, you weren't so bad yourself. Thanks. Good job. Get him. Shh. Thanks. Shh. All right, folks. The votes have been tallied. The results are in. You guys have all done such an amazing job. All right. For our runner-up prize of $10,000, Matt and Missy. And now for our winner, for 25 large, 
Maya Stein, up for her amazing single, Stranger Things. You got to get a chance to perform, right? Yeah. Wow, what an amazing night. Everyone's done such a great... You guys have not made this easy. Wow. Sorry, folks, I guess I missed someone. For the underrated third place prize goes to... Barry Childs! Yeah. Wow. Okay, we're going, we're going. Okay. <laughs> Congratulations, man. This was my grand. Oh. Kids, come on, get up here. Yo, kids, no, you get up here too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Can you believe this? Oh, Denise, you too. No. That was amazing. <clears throat> Great job, man. Thank you. And thank you for forcing my hand, kid. No problem. Sam, what'd you do? Oh, no, 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 she's fine. This whole competition's just a popularity contest anyway. Whoever has the most Instagram or Twitter followers usually wins. That is why I came up with that third place prize for you on the spot. What? You did? You made this up specifically for me? You bet I do. <laughs> Consider that your advance. <laughs> my, my advance on what? Good job here. You got a great sound, man. And our house band's looking for a new guitarist. I'd love for it to be you. Hell, you can start tomorrow if you want. But either way, that money's yours to keep. <laughs> I've dreamed my whole life for this exact moment. Great. It's settled then. I, I can't take the job. Why not? Barry, don't be stupid. I can't, I can't accept the job. There's still something that I gotta take care of. Isn't that right, Dylan? And then the guy who ran the club told my dad that he could go off on stage and perform, and instead of going off on his own, he takes me and Dylan up with him, too. I freestyle like I've been putting out albums my whole life. That's so cool. You guys did all that this weekend. Did you win? You know what was so cool? Is that Jesse, the club manager, created a cash prize specifically for my dad. It would never have happened if Sam hadn't come up with the idea of Lost Minutes. <laughs> so it was a pity prize. And the exact opposite. The guy I have for Barry a job on the spot. You guys are so cool. I don't think a car breaking down is anything to write home about. Don't be jealous just because your dad had to run out on dinner at Noble for a business call. Yeah, don't be jealous. It doesn't look good on you. <laughs> hey, Lucy, maybe you could hear my dad play sometime. You know, your dad being a big music exec and all, I bet you developed a real ear for talent. Oh yeah, Sam says you're like, um, record label royalty. That's pretty cool. So, what's your dad doing now? Yeah, I'm saying, hey.